Welcome, Cancers. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. All right, Cancers. A lot of worries. A lot of worries in this week. Whatever is happening and transpiring. I see a lot of you having conflicts um, and a lot of worries. People are seeing the truth about some issue and situation. I see you're dealing with the Queen of Pentacles. So whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, this Queen of Pentacles uh, back down because this woman um use the sword of truth especially to communicate very clearly okay and some of you are dealing with this queen of swords and this queen of swords woman is, is she this um 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 taurus Virgo, or capricorn person is coming up as a business person or someone who's your supervisor they are going to give you give you an ultimatum whoever you are and whatever is transparent they're definitely going to be giving you an ultimatum so be aware of this because this woman has found out your secrets and whatever. Um, a lot of you think that, uh, oh, okay, so I have this person. And, you know, cancers, there is something that you need to understand. If you think um, that uh, hurting another person and doing secret things on the need to, and hurting another person, um, you have no idea who you are, okay? Because... Um, there is just some people who, all right, number one, not everyone negative energies affect. Number two, um, whatever you do in secrecy, always come out. Whatever you do in secrecy, always come out. The energy of the eye princess is going to be bringing out some information through a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn woman. Whoever this woman is, it's like she connect with the spirit world and she brings and she cut through whatever BS is been playing. Some of you, if you're married to a, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn woman, this woman is going to be finding out that you're cheating or you're not being honest. So be aware of this. So what we're seeing is that Monday, Tuesday, um, strength, strength, trying, um, uh, trying to deal with some um, issues and legal issues uh, that is coming up. Some of you, this is really a sort of trying to figure out and deal with a legal issue. Some of you um, in the, um, are needing um, to find some rest. As some of you, I see um, you're going to be communicating very clearly or you need to communicate very clearly about Libran or stand your ground um, with a Libran, okay? Scent of the week is good. Um, you have, um, oh my God, you have four major arcana. So a lot of you cancers is going to issues, a lot of issues. A lot of you cancers are going through a lot of issues. Whatever the issues is, um, you're going through a lot of issues in this week. So be aware of that. I see innocent leadership and flow. Innocent leadership and flow. What is happening and is transpiring? I see the energy of the Empress. The energy of the Empress. Obviously, some of you are dealing with a Capricorn person. I don't know what you have done to this Capricorn person, but there is no win um, over this person. Because whatever you have done and however you have affected this uh, Capricorn person, I see you're getting back your karma and I see the magician is opening up in order. If you notice the magician is not upright in this reading, so it's not helping you. It is helping the other person. Some of you who have your business, I see the magician is going to be hoping, helping you um, to bring business in your world and this is going to be good. There is some sort of a balance, temperance, balance, um, Situation where your angels are trying to regain balance in a situation. Some of you could not be feeling well. Um, however, this is happening and transpiring. I see the energy of the magician in reverse and the energy of temperance in the reverse is that some of you need to find in a balance in order um, to find yourself again. There is a lot of worries. A lot of you cancers are worrying. Remember, and I don't say it um, because this reading um, is for the second week of August and the week begins uh, 
from the 10th until the 16th. You gotta be aware of this. Um, not everything in this reading will affect um, people. I, you know, a lot of people say that, but I, I really just think that people just listen to these for, um, but not everyone will uh, be affected uh, with energy. Some week it's, uh, it's speaking to you, some week it's not. Okay, so take what um, affects you and let the rest go. So, um, balance is, you know, some of you can just need to find inner, inner balance because I see you're fighting, especially if you are a mother or a wife. I see you have lost some form of balance in your world. It's as if you could be giving your energy to your husband and has lost some form of balance in your world. The four of swords, whatever is happening in your spine, some of you are dealing um, with a Libran or some of you are dealing with a legal issue. It could be that some of you um, could end up in the hospital. Um, yes, some of you could end up in the hospital and I see some of you could be also doing some sort of operation or you found out that you have to go to the hospital and you need to do some sort of operation and you are worried. Ladies and gentlemen, worries is a form of eagle that is trying to take you over, okay? So you have to be aware of this. Worries is a form of eagle that is trying to take you over. So you've got to be aware of this. Then we have innocent leadership and flow. Whenever we have innocent um, innocent, some of you are giving away your power to either your partner or to people around you. Whatever this worries and, and, and contentionness is, is that some of you are finding out something about a Libran that is bringing a lot of, uh, um, a lot of worries in your world. And it could be a legal suit, um, that is bringing this in. Again, we have the Queen of uh, Pentacles. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, she's sitting, she's 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 making her point. Okay. So I don't know who um is dealing. It could be a mother figure, but it could be a boss, but it could be someone who you have uh, crossed their part, and I see they're standing up to you. Um I don't see you having any start. Um, with this person, whatever is transpiring, I see this person is as if they're cold. Okay, whoever the Star is, Virgo, Capricorn person is, is very, very cold. And I think that this person has become cold because of all that has happened and transpired in the past. And this person just stand their ground. They're very, very, very cold. Okay, so you gotta be aware of that. Then we see um, the energy of uh, um, the um, an Aries or Sagittarius. But this could be a legal issue with an Aries man that is going on. Whoever this woman is, is standing her ground. She don't care who this person is and whatever has happened. She's like, done with this. I don't want to deal with you people. Okay. So some of you. Um, a fire sign person has brought some sort of a legal issue in your world, you cancers. And it's as if some of you want to reach out to the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person and, you know, kind of make peace with them. But they have, they're not making any peace with you. So I can tell you that. Okay. So you have double energies separate. So you're dealing definitely with, um, you're dealing definitely with a strength. Okay. And whatever the energy is, the king of wands is here. So some of you are dealing with um, an Aries. Some of you are dealing with a Libran. But whatever it is, this um, legal issue is a very, very powerful. Because what they're realizing and understanding is this. Um, there is a legal issue where these two men have created some form of deceptiveness. And I see you, Cancers, is going to be bringing that out. So whoever this man, these people are, whether it's an Aries businessman or whether it's a brother, a family, a family member or a friend. Um, I see some of you are standing your ground and, and making sure 
that whatever this person have done, that they go to jail for it. And I see this is the reason why this lady, this um, this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn lady is standing her ground. If you notice, she turns your her backs at you. So it could be a legal issue that you are um, dealing with a legal issue that has to do with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn woman. Uh, you could be divorcing this woman. I see this woman is going to be um, winning big time over you, okay? Because whatever Sagittarius and Aries have done, I see you Cancers are, are really, really reaching in and trying to find the last inner strength because this woman has turned her back and she's standing her foot. And trust me, um, this woman is really standing her foot. Now, I see a lot of regrets is coming up for, for some of you with your mom or with your wife, Or with your partner a whole lot of regrets okay i see whatever is happening to your mom if your mom wasn't wasn't well i see an healing is going to be coming in and whenever the star and the balance come up together it's always about health issues so some of you you have some regrets um and your mom um could be having some form of health issues then i see the energy of money the four of pentacles people are finding out that a libran um however this libran has stolen a lot of money um the money was not for the libran but for the taurus virgo capricorn woman and i see this lady is standing her ground and she is going to be oh my god double whammy the magician reverse and upright and this person if you notice the magician is standing up and showing that the money is not for um the Libran, but it is for the Capricorn person, okay? The money is not for the Libran, but it's for the Capricorn person. Um, and she is standing her ground. And if you notice, the magician is pointing out to the Capricorn person because the money is not for some of you. You need to, it's as if the magician is saying, Pay this woman because the worst that you people keep it going and going, give the lady our money, pay the lady her money. And this is what is transpiring. Information is coming out about a Libran and they're finding out some lies and deceptiveness about a Libran. Whoever this Libran is, I see um, the cycle is coming in. So if some of you are sick, it is... Um, some karmatic issues okay it is family issues that um this sick the sickness that you have is coming in from your bloodline um so the sickness is some family issue that you're dealing with and this is uh, coming in from bloodline so express especially if your mom is sick this is uh, um some karmatic issue coming in from bloodline now this is very serious and there is a this is very serious, Cancer. This doesn't come up a whole lot in readings, but this is very serious. So, whatever is transpiring, some of you, Cancer, has done something injustice to a Gemini. And it's as if you, you really search out for this Gemini and really use this Gemini. And you are going to be paying some karmas in this lifetime and like many, many lifetimes to come. Because um, this Gemini um, um, guiding angel is saying, oh my God, this person was being very honest. Very, uh, why, why would you just search out for this person? This person has treated you. And I see you have created some karma and trust me. You're going to be on the karma wheel for the rest of your life, clearing up what you have done to this Gemini. Whether or not this Gemini puts you on the karma wheel, um, it is not that way. It is that this Gemini has been open, honest, and has been helping you and you turn around because you target this Gemini and you're a very sick person. Okay. And this is why you're having a lot of sleepless night because you're very, very disturbed. Okay. You're very disturbed. And whoever you are, what you have done to this Gemini, um, the wheel of fortune with the star 
because you have done something, you have given this Gemini something to eat or have been putting something in this Gemini food for quite some time. You are a sick, manipulating person. Be aware of that. Your karma is about to come back to you. Um, a liberal an investigation is happening. Um, um, you cancers are under investigation. Um, whatever the situation is, I see a lot of you are protecting your wealth. Um, and I see truth is going to be coming out about a liberal. Whoever this liberal is, this liberal is under investigation. And they're going to be finding out uh, the deceptiveness of you and this liberal um, together. And how you and this liberal have target, uh, target um, uh, a Gemini and their family. So I see a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person have turned their backs. I see you're trying to protect yourself from this person. This person doesn't even see you. This person, yeah. Uh, no, this person doesn't even see you. This person has to move on. And I see that you have some worries. Um, you have worries because... It's as if whatever you are trying to um, um, affect this person, this person just turned their backs to you, okay? Um, you have a karmatic situation um, and you have created a whole lot of karma for this person and this person has turned their backs to you and they're, they're just moving on, okay? A lot of you are dealing with some issues and you're trying to protect yourself from a, a, um, a situation I see that some of you, the magician is uh, um, here helping the Queen of Pentacles because they know that some of you had used some witchcraft black magic to hurt this person. And it's as if this person gets, it's like um, a magnetic shield around them against you cancers um, because people have found out what you cancers have done. Um, a legal issue against a Leo man, you're going to be, um, uh, successful. Um, yeah. Okay. And I see Elin is going to be coming in for some of you ladies, older ladies that have been having some form of health issue, but this health issue is coming from past life. Then we see a situation with a Libran and some of you are trying to find Inner strength to deal with a uh, Libran and a uh, Aries. So whoever this businessman is, is a very deceptive businessman. I see the energy of the magician and definitely, I don't know who you cancers are, but trust me in your reading, is that the, um, the spirit guides and the universe is saying pay or return the money to the Taurus, the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. Uh, a lot of you have stolen money from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. And I see that they found out that some of you cancers have worked together with a Libran in order to create some falseness and deceptiveness. And I see truths is going to be coming out. And this is the reason why I see they, they and whatever is going on here is like divine intervention is coming in. Need a uh, witchcraft. Where is, where is, where is, where is, is going to be over for some of you. Whatever the where is, is with a liberant is going to be over. A liberant is really on the investigation. And uh, if you're in a relationship with a liberant, I see whatever is transpiring, I see you're walking away from this liberant. Um, whatever the where is, is and is transpiring, I see you're turning your back. Um, a Gemini is going to be re um, released out of a deceptive play that you cancers have brought a Gemini in. And I'm telling you, whoever you are that has sucked, has, um, um, you know, um, target this Gemini, you are a very sad person. There is something really psychic wrong with you. This Gemini, whoever you are, because obviously you're listening to this, this Gemini pick you up from nothing. And has tried to give you something. You lied to this person. You steal from this person. And you steal from their families and friends. You're sick. You're really sick. Okay. 
people who steals lie and create issues for other people or psychically unbalanced go check yourself out because you are in balance okay and this is the reason why all of these issues are happening on the planet because people are now realizing oh um their psychic is off okay because of the things that you do um and what people do not understand is that whatever you do to another person you are going to be um, receiving 10 times the same thing back. And I see that some of you cancers are sorry that you have ever done. And it's too late. I see you young ladies have really took down a young man for everything that he had. And this is a sick, sick game. Um, and, uh, you know, some people just... Uh, um, think that they can get away with things because they use uh, witchcraft and black magic. But trust me, this is a time when witchcraft and black magic seems to be failing as ever because Mother Hurt is deciding to release the negative energy and bring back the polarity of light and darkness that works together and merge and work together. It is sick what you have done to this Gemini. Um, and, uh, uh, you ladies that is with, with a Gemini, if this man dies or their friends or their family, you're going to be the first one that is on the investigation. I know you're listening. You thought that you were the cat's pajama. All right, girlfriend. I'll see you. Ladies and gentlemen, innocent leadership and flow. It is, um, one of the most beautiful thing, use the energy in this week and uh, let's move on. I love you guys. Please like, share these readings because uh, um, it is, it is the, the, the ship of energy is changing on this planet. Be aware of this. Namaste.